Yo, what's up everyone, Ufo here, and today we have got the new update inside Clash Royale. The new update, of course, comes with a new champion, the Mighty Miner, and today we are going to unlock him and use him. I really hope you guys go on to enjoy this video. If you guys do, make sure you guys leave a like. Leaving a like always really helps out the channel. It lets me know you guys enjoy the content and you want to see more of it. Also, while you're down there, if you guys could subscribe, that'd be awesome. And without any further delay, let's hop right into it. So I've actually been saving a Royal Wild chest here, and that's because I knew there was going to be a new champion of course a royal wild chest guarantees us a champion and we are looking for only one champion the mighty miner and this chest is definitely going to give it to us we get gold to begin with we then get some common wild cards turns into rascals aka gold rare wild cards some epic wild cards turns into hunters a legendary wild card turns into a mega knight and the big one the champion you guys can see the mighty miners in there and we get the mighty miner easy unlocked and of course we do have another Another royal wild chest here from the crown chests this does also guarantee us another champion and we're hoping for that second mighty miner so we can level him up we get some arrows some rare wild cards some epic wild cards turns into mirrors a legendary wild card and another champion which champion is it going to be hopefully the mighty miner and boom it is who would have thought we can now get him to level 12 exciting times but wait there's more we have a book of books we are going to use a book of books on him to get him to level 13 but wait there's even more because we have not brought past Rael yet so we use the best card in the game the credit card our purchase was successful there we go we unlock past Rael and this means we also get the second book of books and just like that day one we have a max mighty miner I'm too good at this game what can I say the skill is unreal and now we're going to use him on some ladder I pushed up yesterday I'm now top 3000 in the world boom now that we have a max mighty miner we are going to use him in splash yard i think this is going to be one of the best archetypes for him just because he has a lot of hit points and he's going to be great at counter potion he has 3100 hit points for a four elixir card is kind of crazy if we compare that to a valkyrie a valkyrie only has 2600 and she's getting nerfed so the mighty miner definitely belongs in this type of archetype let's go into some top ladder now and test him out okay so we are into a game and really with splash yard you want to wait for double elixir this guy goes with a Skarmy, so we clear Barbarian Bell. And we get some damage. He's also Lava Hound, which is kind of bad. We are going to push opposite lane here. But unfortunately, this means our Mighty Miner won't get a ton of value this game. So honestly, I'm just going to skip this game and move on to the next one. Oh my, I just thought of something very big brained. But look at this, right? The Mighty Miner right now is distracting that baby dragon. What we're going to do is is use his ability and graveyard so we're going to use his ability here and it's going to pop out right on his tower that is so good imagine if he had full health that would have been like an inferno dragon instantly on your tower oh two tower games are very good with mighty minor like i can basically just drop him here and then he's on the enemy's tower like i'm going to end up losing this game right now for content but look at this look at what i just worked out you go like this your ability on the tower he's melted it i won holy that is overpowered but it's like how do you defend this he literally just on the tower he plays a lumberjack in front that's not enough and i take the entire thing because he's so tanky okay so we're into a game this guy starts with a dark prince we do a mighty miner it, and he has an electro wizard you absolutely hate to see that the mighty miner he works like an inferno dragon so he will keep getting reset by that electro wizard if i let it happen he dropped a peck of go 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 is this about to be an entire tower eaten like a snack i think it is that's a lot of damage oh so close okay i don't know how the mighty miner does against a peck but we're about to find out not the best not the worst mm. oh no we've lost our tower whatever shall we do we are so scared because we are graveyard am i good at acting i really think i could be in movies wow this guy's so good with his peck of bridge spam oh my goodness he wasted his electro wizard as well let's mighty minor your pekka whoops what's that we're on your tower what's that you can't defend because you wasted all your elixir you zap to reset him, but that's not going to do it. What's that? We just take your entire tower. <laughs> oh my, it's so cheesy. It works every time. This guy says good game. He knows. He knows. He says, oops. Yeah, oops, buddy. Oops is right. I didn't use the ability. He tried to predict me. It didn't work. I just poisoned your tower. Oh, uh, good game. I am the best mighty minor player in the game right now. Okay, I'm going to hit him with the cheese. He just played a Valkyrie and a Musketeer down that left lane. Boom. 
opposite lane, he's tanking for the graveyard. That is so good. That is unbelievable. He locked onto the tower. Look at the damage lead I just got. Every time I'm freaking out, by the way, I'm leaking a ton of elixir and he throws the wow. He knows he just got outplayed. I wasn't going to show this game because honestly, like he's a 2.6 hog rider. There's not a lot of value for my mighty miner to get, but that just happened. The plays I'm doing right now is unbelievable. Should we do it to him again? Just dip to the other lane and that's, that's game winning. That just won me the game. I'm too good with this card. Okay, into a game. I'm really hoping this guy plays beat down so I can show you the mighty miner on defense. Come on, I know you want to be a golem deck. Okay, a skeleton king. That's a good start. Mighty miner, a 4 for 4 trade. He says, wow, he knows I'm paid to win. Okay, and a minion horde. Yeah, I have no clue what this deck is. Is he mortar? Really bad time for a pump there, buddy. Oh, he's actually golem. I was not expecting a golem. Anyway, we pretty much took his left tower. And here we go. We are about to see the mighty miner on defense against the golem and just look at that he is going to absolutely melt him now unfortunately if the golem walks out of range then it will reset the charge but you know the golem didn't really make it to my tower at all just fantastic defense this guy's laughing he's having a mental breakdown Okay, going to do a graveyard like this, just so we take out the pump as well. Okay, free poison. We still take out the pump. Another golem. No problem, because we have a mighty miner. I'm going to be very honest with you guys. The mighty miner is a lot more powerful than I thought. I thought he was just going to be like an inferno dragon, which isn't that amazing. But he actually has so many uses. That's kind of crazy. Again, he just melt a golem. Oh, he's golem clone. I mean, we win. But yo, that's going to wrap it up for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, make sure you guys leave a like. Of course, subscribe if you have not already. The Mighty Miner is definitely broken and one of the better champions in the game. Let me know what you guys think about him in the comment section. Am I the best Mighty Miner player in the world? Boost my ego. Go on. It's fine. You can do it. And as always, make sure you guys take care, brush your hair, and peace out. Yeah.